the first thing we're going to do is draw the fin unit. I'm going to start by going top view and going to sketch mode. Select the plane that we're doing it. And for center circle, we're going to push C. And then we're going to make the diameter 25.5 millimeters. We're going to finish this sketch. And we're going to go to an offset plane. Select this plane. And we're going to go up 57.3 millimeters. On this offset plane, we're going to draw a circle, a center circle, and we're going to make its diameter 24.8. Finish this sketch. Then we're going to use the loft tool to make these two sections solid. I'll select the top of the fin unit and make another circle at 23.9 millimeters. I'm going to hit the E key for extrusion, select the center circle, and I'm going to extend it to 6.5 millimeters. Select the top again and we're going to make another circle this time at 22 millimeters. Going to hit E again to make this extrusion and this time we're going to go all the way through. Then we rotate it to view the bottom and we'll select the bottom here and we're going to make a center circle and this center circle is going to be 23.9 then we're going to hit E for extrusion and we're going to extrude a distance of negative 6.5 millimeters now we got the fin can drawn it's time to draw a fin so I'm going to go ahead and hide the fin and make sure I'm on this plane here and we're going to draw a sketch and we're going to draw a, a, square, a rectangle starting from this point we're going to make its height 57.3 and we're going to make its width 26.5 then we're going to draw another square just for a reference point 26.5 and 26.5 and we're going to do the same thing we can just use we can just use a line for this one the width of it 26 the length of it 26.5 okay we're also going to use a line go from this point to this point and then we're going to go from this point to this point next I'm going to draw a little square down the middle here you know, roughly about this point here and we're going to go down and we're going to have it stick out this much and that gives us our basic fin shape so then we're going to finish this sketch now that we got the basic shape of our fin drawn we need to do some extrusions first I'm going to extrude this little detail here and the thickness of this it's going to be uh, what am I drawing saying I say about 3.2 and so what we're going to have to do is we want to do it as a symmetric design and half of 3.2 is going to be 1.6 and hit OK we want it we, yeah this is going to be a new body so we want to keep a new body the sketch goes away so we want to re 
show the sketch there. So we just hit the eyeball there. Going to extrude again. I'm going to select these little corners here. And this time, symmetric. And this time, it's going to be um, 0.8 in both directions. Oops. 0.8. Okay. And what I'm going to do here is use the chain for tool, which is right here, and select these edges here. And then what I want to use is distance and angle. The angle I'm going to go with is 4 degrees and the distance of 8 millimeters. Then I'm going to use the fillet tool and select these two angles, I mean edges. And then move it to about, I think that's good enough. I'm going to look at the rear end of the fin now. And once again, use the fillet tool and select these corners. And then we're going to do the same thing and just try to get as close as we can. Let's try 0.8. That might work. Yep, 0.8 is good. And there we have our completed fin. Now that we have the fin drawn, it's time to join it to the fin can. So what we're going to do is we're going to select the fin and just move it out of the way temporarily. Then we're going to show the fin can, reselect the fin, and they're going to join it to the body here, if ever so slightly. And what we want to do is we want to make sure it is embedded in the plastic on both ends and not sticking too far in. And that looks perfect. Next step is we got to give this rocket four fins. And so to do that, we go to create pattern, circular pattern. Then we want to select bodies, which is selected. The object we want is fin. The axis is going to be the center axis. And then we go and say four fins. Then finally, we're going to select everything and we're going to hit the combine button. And it's okay. And now that our fin can's done, we're going to call this the Moon Rider Fin Unit. And then we're going to get it ready to print. If it says TL, hit OK. Save.